What's poppin' Wolfpack? I'm Dylan Brazier. And I'm Josiah Edwards. Today is November 4th, and we're here with your disciplinary announcements. Hey, Dylan, did you watch the election last night? You already know. I'm watching it 24-7. Yeah, it is crazy. It's going to be a close one. Let's check out the election results with Ashley. The results tonight have been phenomenal. This is going to take a while. We're going to have to be patient until we, uh, the hard work of tallying the votes is finished. Uh, I truly do believe, as you do, that we are on the road to victory and we will make America great again, again. Thank you, Mr. And it ain't over till every vote is counted, every ballot is counted. And I want to thank every one of you who came out and voted in this election. While both candidates gave their speeches, many riots broke out all over the country. We're looting the wrong buildings here. This all. time you watch this video. Currently, Biden is in the lead with 238 electoral college votes, while Donald Trump has 213 electoral college votes. Uh, yo, Dylan, there's a new student-led tobacco and vaping training. Have you heard? Yeah, I've heard. They teach the dangers about the industry and products. Let's pass it on over to me and Paula for more info. Hey, Dylan, want to hit my vape? I don't know, man. I heard if you vape, you're five to seven times more likely to test positive for coronavirus. Oh, shoot. Really? Plus, the CDC states that smokers are in a higher risk category for a severe illness for COVID-19. This is why it's important to know the facts to keep your friends and family safe. That's right, Wolfpack. Another voiceover by yours truly, Dylan Brazier. But this time, it's about vaping. Let's get into it. In the next few weeks, CO will provide two tobacco and vaping advocacy training sessions on Zoom. The first one is the rise of vaping, which will cover physical and mental health effects of vaping, the industry's tactics to hook youth, and what you can do about it. Sign up at bit.ly slash cohs hyphen no hyphen vape. The second training is Taking Down Tobacco 101. We'll talk about the health impacts, the tobacco's industry, aggressive marketing, the environmental impact, and how you can help others. Sign up at bit.ly slash cohs hyphen no hyphen tobacco. Both trainings will be student-led guided presentations with some awesome games and interactive activities. Look forward to seeing you there. Well, that's all, guys. I'm Dylan Brazier. Back to the Anchors. Come on, guys. Don't vape. Now let's move it on to John for sports. What's up, Wolfpack? I'm John Sheehan, back at it again with your weekly sports update. This week, let's talk about CO Sports. Men's soccer is a spring sport this year. Tryouts will begin February 22nd of 2021. Don't worry, though, Wolfpack, you have plenty of time to get fit for a championship run. More details soon to come. Interested in playing women's basketball this upcoming season? Contact Coach Roth at proth at egusd.net for more information. The men's basketball program is starting up the Alpha Pack. Conditioning starts November 2nd and November 3rd at CO. This will be open to all interested in playing freshman, JV, and varsity basketball in the upcoming season. You must bring a current physical and a signed COVID-19 waiver in order to participate. Varsity conditioning is Monday through Thursday from 7.30 p.m. to 9 p.m. in the CO gym. Freshman and JV conditioning is Tuesday through Thursday from 7 p.m. to 8.30 p.m. in the CO gym. If you have any questions, please email cohsmensbasketball at gmail.com. That's all I have for you this week, Wolfpack. I'm John Sheehan, and this has been your weekly sports update. Well, that's all we have for you today, Wolfpack. I'm Dylan Brazier. And I'm Josiah Edwards. And remember, the strength of the pack is the wolf. And the strength of the wolf is the pack. Happy National Happy Candy National Day, Wolfpack.